Hello everyone, my name is Dami from Museum. Thank you for watching my channel. This year, I'm going to try something new. I'll be taking some requests from the comment section below. As requested by one of the viewers, here is the lesson from Mia and Sebastian's theme from La La Land. score you will find three sharps on F C G Pa Do Sol whenever you see these three notes you have to play on the black keys instead of the white keys so F sharp C sharp G sharp the Mia and Sebastian's theme even start with these three notes. I will play separate hand in a slow tempo. As I play, I will tell you which finger would be the best and some other tips. I will play right hand first. Start with the C sharp. Time signature is in 3 4. 3 4. 1 2 3. Start with the C sharp, C sharp, F sharp, G sharp, A, G sharp, F sharp, D, 1, 2, 3, D again, F sharp, G sharp, A, G sharp, F sharp, C sharp, 1, two, three, same as very beginning, one more time, C sharp, D, two, three, second line, I'll start with the B, A, G sharp, A, G sharp, F sharp, C sharp, one, two, three, up to here. Now that's what we call one phrase. The second phrase is exactly the same as the first one. The only difference is the second phrase is played in octaves. Octave means you play the same note of high. So those are octaves. The tips to octaves is to set your fingers and move your whole hand as a unit. So as you see it, you set your fingers and move whole entire hand as a unit. That's the best way to play octaves. Now let's start the second phrase. Start with the C sharp. One, two, three. C sharp, F sharp. G sharp, A, 
G sharp, F sharp, D, one, two, three, D again, F sharp, G sharp, A, G sharp, F sharp, C sharp, one, two, three, C sharp, F sharp, G sharp, A, G sharp, F sharp, D, one, two, three, B, A, G sharp, A, G sharp, F sharp, C sharp, one. And then the next note is E, F, G, A. Now, the third phrase, next phrase is the third one. You start on F sharp and D. And C sharp, E, C sharp, B, A, F sharp. One, two, three. C sharp, B, A, B, A, G sharp, F sharp, one, two, three. Now lift it and bottom note F sharp and top note D sharp, I mean just D, regular D. C sharp, B, C sharp, B, A, F sharp, one. Two, three, G sharp. The next one, bottom note is on E. Top note is on C sharp. One. The next one is E. Now the last note is E sharp. Now if you see it, E sharp, there is no sharp. There is no black key to play it. Then, in this case, you will play the next note, which is F, regular white note. So E sharp is F, pa. And then the next one, F has a sharp originally, so you will play this note. And octave again, A and C sharp. Okay, up to here. We just played second phrase in octave. The next phrase is played in chords. Tips to play chords are playing smoothly and connecting melody lines. There are also certain fingers to use. As I play, I will explain it how to play chords well. Starting with the D, finger number three, F sharp, on five, go one, two, three. Next to no C sharp and E to four. B and D, C sharp and E, B and D. Now here is the tip, you leave the D first, hold the thumb, Cross it over your finger number two, and then play at A, and C sharp, and one, three. I will play it one more time. Three, five. Up to here, just smoothly connecting. Here is the tip goes. Now lift, hold the thumb. That way you can smoothly connecting melody line because this is the melody line. Okay, the next one. This is the melody line, but it played in double chord, so you have to hold it down, smoothly connecting it. Two, three. The next phrase is starting on E sharp, which is F. And G sharp, D and F, C sharp and E sharp, so F. This is easy to miss, so be careful with it. B and D, one, three on A, C sharp, and G sharp and B. Now this is the same way. Lift your finger number three, hold it, this thumb, and go A sharp and B. And this is the next one. Leave two, hold the four, and drop two, three on G sharp and A. 
So if I go slow, leave, leave, one more time. Leave three, leave two. I will play it one more time. And then I have sharp with thumb and slide it down. That's the way how you're supposed to play. Now the next note is start on D and F sharp, G sharp, F sharp, G sharp, A, again. Now slide it down, thumb to C sharp, and finger number two is on F sharp, G sharp, F sharp, G sharp, a next note is a C E F sharp. But you have to keep holding these two notes because it's quarter note, so you have to hold it for longer. And then you can leave it. A F sharp. B the next chord is B D sharp. An F natural, so we'll play like this. And then, in exactly the same note, you play active higher. B, B sharp, F. So you go. The very last measure of the first page, E, G sharp, and A sharp. B, A sharp. C sharp. Now, the top of the first page, the second page, D sharp, G natural, and A sharp. So it will be this note. You play at the same time. B, A sharp, B, C sharp. The next note is an F sharp, B. And then C natural, so you will just play regular white key. C, B, C, and then finger number three on C sharp, and D. The next chord is G, B, C sharp, and E sharp. So G, B, C sharp, E. Up to here. 